either. Oh, well, what's going on? Hello. I know it has been a few days. It's been a few days. Howdy. Howdy. Good evening. Good evening. <clears throat> What's up? What's up? Hello. 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 A little late night live tonight. A little late night live. Later than usual, anyways. Hello, hello. It has been a few freaking days. I'm trying to think of what's even happened. Not much, honestly. Not much has happened. Started a new job. Finishing that tomorrow. So that'll be good. Um, Jill it is indeed. Elizabeth, hello. Oh, Dan, hello. Hello, Daniel. Tanya, I gotcha. Wendy, hello. Hello, hello. Diane, it is going good. It's going good. How far have you got? I honestly have not watched any TV in the last, well, like, not much. Anyways, not much. I have not. I have finished the first episode, but I have not started the second yet. Not yet. Hello, bonjour. Bonjour. I'm good. How are you? feeling much better. Who's wide? Who's wide? But yes, I'm feeling much better for sure. For sure. Just tired. You know, a little tired now. But, you know, that's it. That's it. That's all. And... Yes, I finished Manifest a while ago. A while ago. Not long after the new season came out, um, I binged it. I binged it pretty quickly. Wait, there's a new season? Another one? Oh, new up! I have not seen it. Fuck. I didn't even know. I didn't even know. I'm not going to quit Game of Thrones. I won't. I'll have to hop back and forth between the two. I'll have to hop back and forth. Johnny. Straddle it too. I guess you could say that, yeah. I guess you could say that. that name the bitch is back <laughs> yeah I muted uh whatever that was I don't know what they were going off about no idea no I'm not Tina for which which show are we talking about here which show are we talking about 
Game of Thrones or Manifest? Or other? Oh, Game of Thrones. Okay, I got you. I got you. Good morning from Qatar. Good morning. Good morning. Gotta be Game of Thrones. Gotta be. It's a real treat. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Lori, hello. Oh, Johnny boy. From the panda himself. The panda himself. Hola. Hello. Hello. Attaboy, Johnny. Attaboy, Johnny. Look at that bling, too, eh? Look at that bling. It's a big ass chain. Mr. Saturday Live. How did it go? It was a good time, you know? It was a good time. The licorice? Well, I haven't had any licorice in a minute. It has been a minute. And no, the tan is from work. It is from work. I can't sit still long enough to watch a series. See, I... I can, but I have to be like really into it. But like, I guess there's no really like in between. But yeah, I'm usually I'm usually like focused where it's like you know I'll watch like a few hours, not a few hours, like an hour or two. So usually like an episode or two a night. Sometimes more, you never know. Depends on the night. But yeah, I binge them pretty quickly, usually. <clears throat> I did not golf today. What dinner are we on? I think I'm gonna skip second dinner tonight. I think I'm gonna skip second dinner. And, uh, yeah, hello from New Jersey. Hello. Hello, hello. And then, yeah. When is the rematch for the bet? You can do the rematch tomorrow if you'd like. I guess this isn't the night for the bet, eh? Let's do the rematch tomorrow. Yeah, no second dinner tonight. No, I'm skipping out. I'm skipping out. Thursday. Yeah, we can do Thursday. We can do Thursday. I will really go live. Yes. Yes, I will. As long as it's not Thursday or Friday. Oh, fuck. Hello. 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 What is the bet? I'm new here. Somebody want to explain the bet for Kara, Kara, Kara. I have to work late Thursday. I'm seeing a lot of Thursday. A lot of Thursdays are the fucking no bueno. 
feel like tomorrow. Friday wouldn't be good. Friday would not be good because I have the golf. Golf league. And odds are probably pretty good that I will be intoxicated after said golf league. So it won't be Friday, that's for sure. Definitely will not be Friday. Yeah, we'll keep it Thursday. We'll just keep it Thursday for now. Maybe we'll start it a bit later to give everybody time. Hopefully, like, we'll start it at, like, 9. Probably, like, 9 o'clock. I've got this in the bag, just so you know. Like, I can do this, no problem. As long as I don't slip up. I might fuck up. I don't want to say I have this in the bag. I can't say like confidently. I'm not going to lie. I have confidence. I think I'm going to win. But there is also a very high chance that I will slip up the one. I did indeed have that for dinner tonight. No canceling, no. I'm confident, but you know, I've been known to slip up. Well, not that, not well. Yeah, no. When it comes to food, I might fuck her. I might fuck up. I might fuck up. You know. Je ne sais pas. I don't remember. Oh, this is for my driver. Well, it was for my driver. I no longer have that driver. <laughs> no way. <clears throat> no way. We're going to come through. <coughs> We're going to get the dub. We're going to win this bet. You're gonna win, win this bet. No deleting. Hard headed. You think I'm hard headed? Determined, stubborn, saw high maintenance. I am not high maintenance. I'm not high maintenance, okay, Christine? I'm just a simple guy. I'm just a simple guy. Low maintenance. That's all. Not bougie. Not bougie. Kara, thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Simple man. Exactly. Simple man. You are the worst high maintenance. Wait. You are the worst. And capitalized worst high maintenance because you give the illusion. Again with the capitals of low maintenance. I simply do not believe that, okay? Listen, even my own mother, okay, who's lived with me for 20, almost four years, all right? 
She even came out and said on the live that I am not high maintenance, all right? I'm just food high maintenance. Only in one category, okay? Only in one category. That doesn't like... No, she wouldn't lie to save face. Are you kidding me? Do you, like she's, are you kidding me? You've heard her call me out on live so many times. She wouldn't do that. She wouldn't do that. She was telling the truth. I am, however, all right, dramatic sometimes, all right, I might be a little dramatic sometimes. So is Parker apparently, like, he's having some traumatic dream right now. Nikki, thank you. Thank you. Not me. Yeah, but I think I'm food high maintenance because like you know, if I'm like starving, like starving, and I know my mom is going to be home in like 2 hours to make food, I won't make food myself. I'll just wait for for my mom to get home and make food, you know? Like I just won't make it really myself. I will, like, if I'm by myself, like, if, you know, there's no other option, then obviously, you know, I will. But, like, so I, that's why I think I'm, like, <laughs> food high maintenance. Other than that, like, yeah, like, I like what I like, and I just eat a fuckload of it. And, like, it's pretty basic, you know, like, it's pretty, pretty basic. Um, my, my, <laughs> mildly needy. No, I'm not that. I'm not not anymore. All right, not anymore. I'm not needy. I'm just needy for food. Yeah, see, that's a prime example. Hence, why I was even able to accumulate twenty two free pizzas. I think that should speak for itself. Yeah. Lasagna. Oh, lasagna is so good. Lasagna is bomb. Have you seen the landscaping attachments for Crocs? Yes, I have. They're pretty nifty. Pretty nifty. That came out of nowhere. That came out of nowhere. Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. There is a lot of pollen outside. A lot of pollen outside. And a lot of cat, cat fur, cat hair. Did you just hear that? She walked out.
I have no idea. That uh, was Mabel. The new tick disease. No? What the fuck? Babe Siosis? Babe? Babe Siosis? What is it? I did indeed get a new keyboard. Indeed I did. Oh, it's like really a major issue if you have like a compromised immune system. I don't know, the Lone Star, the Lone Stars. Tech still fucking tops it for me. Obviously, Lyme disease would not be fun. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Are we going to start our have a tick rant? No, I won't go off on a ticker. I don't have one right now. I do not have one right now. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. We are awake. The beast is awake. No, I don't have rant energy right now. I don't. Sorry, I wish I did. Stone. The fuck was that, Parker? What was that? Oh, you didn't miss. You really didn't miss much. Didn't miss much. You know, we're just kind of chilling. Just kind of chilling, talking about ticks. Good old ticks. Fun stuff. Participate. Just trying to get me fired up. You're just trying to get me fired up. I know what you're trying to do. Alright. I'm on to you. I'm on to you. Yeah, Parker's making noises over there. I don't know what the fuck he's up to. But he's just living his best life really, you know, Sean. Sean. Uh, Rana, I do indeed. Indeed I do. The Canadian shower.
the Canadian shower. Oh. oh no, it seems like everybody and their mother has been out for a fucking Sunday drive on every fucking day of the week so far, like for the last like four days at least. It's absolutely ridiculous. Right in Tanner. Tanner. There he goes. Well, no, because that's seriously been fucking pissing me off. Like, I've actually had serious fucking road rage the last couple days because these people are driving under the fucking speed limit on back roads that you can't even pass on because they're so hilly or windy and shit. And it's like, fuck, man. Just go, dude. Like, what are you so scared of, man? You can see. It's daytime. It's fucking daytime. Bright as shit. Go the speed limit, at least. You know? A cop's not going to pull you over if you go five over the speed limit. Like, it's just not going to happen. It just won't happen. Like, seriously, everybody and their goddamn mother has been out fucking on a Sunday drive. It's absolutely... Uh, like, buddy... Fucking move it. Just fucking move it, really. Just move it. Ram them. Yeah, I know, eh? Road rage much? Oh, I do. I do get it. Yeah, it does. It, it grinds my gears sometimes, you know? Like, especially when you've got a place to be. Like, when you're trying to go somewhere and you're stuck behind a fucking bum who's going, like, fucking 75 kilometers an hour in an 80. There's nothing more frustrating than that because it's like, man. And right after you pass a speed limit sign, too, like, you literally drive right past the speed limit sign. It's like, you're going slow as fuck. You're literally inching across the road right now. There's no way in hell you didn't see that sign that says 80 kilometers an hour. How do you not mm, step on it? A little bit, you know? Like, I, like, fuck. It's so annoying. That happened to me today. We, we went right past the speed limit sign and this fucker was still going 10 under and I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe I actually couldn't believe it. I'm like, dude. Luckily, I knew a back way that I could take that were side roads that nobody fucking takes ever because nobody really knows that route. Or else I was about, I've never done this before. I've never been behind somebody and gave them a honk to be like, hey, like fucking let's go. But I was like this close today. I was this close from just giving them a, eh, come on, man. But then my road, like the side road came up. So I'm like, fuck this. Ooh, see you later. And off I went. Because it's like, fuck, man. Just, just give her. Just give her. It sounded like a semi truck honk. <laughs> I can assure you, my the honk on my truck is definitely not, does not sound like a semi truck. I'll cut across a field if I have to. That's like some driving you'd see in like Florida. Like in fucking Miami. Or even Tampa. We saw some wild shit in Tampa too. Was her uncle? <laughs> The uncle. I'm not nice when I drive. Okay. I used to live in Tampa. Ah, uh, Tina. 
That explains it. Flipped them off, even. Did she not realize that it was her uncle? Until, like, after the fact? Or, like, was she still just right chapped? Austin is the worst traffic I've driven in, really. Mine's definitely been New York. New York was pretty fucking bad. I mean, I didn't personally drive in it, and there's no way in hell I ever would. But, yeah. She was mortified. That's so funny. At that point, you kind of just have to laugh about it, like... What are you going to do? You know? I call him Drunkle. Damn. Damn. Drivers are crazy. Yeah. The traffic, especially coming out of the airport at fucking in New York, was insane. It was insane. An absolute shit show and a half. I would not be, um, would not be fun. They're like, yeah, I would not be driving. Driving in Toronto is enough fun for me, you know? That's as about a, as much fun for me as I'll uh, I'll take. Other than that, no thanks. Samantha, that'll be a good time, I'm sure. A good time, Margie, hello. Hello, hello. What airport? Like the one that we came from in New York. I believe it was JFK. No, it wasn't JFK. What was the other one? I forget what the other LaGuardia. Yeah. That's what it was. LaGuardia. That's right. I flew out of JFK. Which sounds like an STD. LaGuardia. <laughs> <Like, where are laughs> yeah, it fucking does. JFK is the way, eh? Landing at LaGuardia is scary. AF. See, I don't really remember much about it other than it was fucking absolutely packed trying to get out of there in Uber. It was like, yeah, I feel like we're just not going to get anywhere. We're going to get to our hotel in seven hours. What? Wow. I know pretty quickly, kind of, considering. Lisa, good night. Good night. How long did it take? I don't remember exactly. I don't remember. LAX? Cali? California? Holy Alicia typos. I don't think Alicia's here. At LAX, the Cali girls, Cali has their own traffic. I feel like Cali's its own world inside of the States, you know? I feel like Cali is like, kind of like its own little
Being content. Stu was just like staring at the fucking wall. That was kind of cre- that was kind of creepy. That was like some shit you'd see out of Paranormal Activity. You just see a pet, just like wide-eyed, staring at a fucking blank wall. I'm so tired. I don't even know what I'm like. I don't even know. I don't even know. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. Rachel, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. I have a ghost that hangs out on my stairs. Like, for real. Have you seen it? You need to check out the Cali vibe. I definitely would check out Cali. I definitely will at some point. I feel like you just got to, you know? You just got to hear it all day. What? That's some freaky shit. I wouldn't be able to fucking sleep at night. Oh, you will. Wow. Have to. I told Tina about it. Stop lollygagging. Get to LA. Stop lollygagging. Coon. Coon. Let's go to law. Let's go to law. Law. Charleston, Obama. Where's Charleston again? Is that in Boston? Charleston, Charlestown. Charleston, no, that's in New North Carolina, right? Yeah, North Carolina, South Carolina. South Carolina. Oh, in the sticks. Charlestown is in Boston. Oh. Let's go back to talking about Cali. <laughs> Carolina. No one ever comes to Detroit. <laughs> yeah, Lainey, no offense, but I don't think I, I cannot see myself ever coming to Detroit. Don't take it personally. It's not you. It's everybody else in the city. Michigan? Oh yeah, no, Michigan. Some of my family used to live in, I don't know where exactly in Michigan they lived. Somewhere in Michigan. I'd say come to Indiana, but I don't even want to be here. What's in Indiana? You don't really hear much about Indiana, or at least not in Canada, you don't. Dan, yeah, you got it. It sounds like you're quite familiar with it. T Swift will be in Detroit next weekend. T Swizzle, absolutely nothing. Cornfields and cows. Car races in Indy.
That's the whole Midwest, cornfields and cows. <laughs> cornfields and cows. Hmm. Purdue. Purdue. I'm trying to think of another. What's another state that's like really like just dry? Like there's just nothing there, nothing going on. I feel like South Dakota and North Dakota. You don't really hear much about South and North Dakota. Nebraska, Idaho. Idaho was the one I was trying to think of. I, I knew it was an I. Kansas. Kansas. Not Massachusetts, it's pretty moist here. Yeah. Massachusetts, Idaho once. Idaho, you know. The majority of Australia is desert. Everyone just lives around the coast. The middle is a lot of nothing. A lot of nothing, just the outback. Idaho, Utah, things that can kill you. I feel like, I feel like everything in Australia can kill you. Like whenever you're watching those discovery shows and it's like, oh, look at that ant right there, but be careful. One little bite from that guy has enough poison to knock you dead in nine minutes if you don't get help quick enough. It's like, holy fuck, that little fucking thing? Are you kidding me? It's absolutely insane. That's your best accent. <laughs> that wasn't bad. The Aussie said it wasn't that bad. Thank you, Eve. Thank you. Thank you very much. Perfect accent. Thank you. Thank you, ladies. Thank you very much. I'm proud of myself. Thank you. You know, I've been training hard, putting the work in, and uh, I guess as you can see, the results are starting to show. You know, it's just like working out slow and steady, but you know, if you uh, stay persistent, eventually you'll, uh, you'll get there. The dancing a beaver, dancing Brenda. Hello, 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 hello. I'm fading, I'm fading out. I'm fading out. Wendy with the hearts, much love, much love. The tat, the tattoo. I've got to go to bed soon too. You have children to teach, Dennis. Good children to teach.
Yeah, my hands are heavy. That's so heavy. Christine with the football, much love. Let's go to bed together. I'll be off for hours. Hours and hours and hours. I will not be off for hours. Is your palm itchy? It means you're getting money. No, my I believe my palms are itchy because they are absolutely destroyed. I was handling patio stones today and not wearing gloves. And um, yeah, it, it'll muck up your hands pretty quickly. That's exactly what happened. Well, the camera doesn't really pick it up, but like, it just dries them right out. Like, can't really see. But quite, quite dry. Doesn't hurt. Doesn't hurt. Just, you know. No, fuck the gloves. Fuck the gloves. Just gotta fucking go for it, you know? Toughen up your skin. <laughs> Rana. Rana, favorite football team. Gotta go with the Bills. Gotta go with the Bills, you know? Brenda, good old Brenda. Imagine this is a gift, Dennis. The bills, the bills. Yes, Laney, ladies, ladies, we are going to call it a night. I'm gassed, I'm tired. I'm fading out. We will be back tomorrow though. We'll be back tomorrow night, back at the usual time. 8.30 p.m. EST. So stay tuned for that. Sleep well, Chanel, much love. Beth, good night. Ladies, sleep well. Have a great day at work tomorrow. And as always, a good night. And love you, bye. Ciao, ciao.